In this video, we will tell you how to connect Telematron to your vending machine. Telematron is delivered with all the necessary cables. An antenna is also included. Two cables are used to connect Telematron to the machine. One of them connects the modem to a payment bus. The second is connected to the auditing connector. Audit cables may vary for different machines. Let's take a closer look at the cables. The type of cable for connecting to the payment bus depends on the protocol of the vending machine. For vending machines operating in MDB mode, U016 MDB cable is used, which is connected to the gap of the payment bus between the vending machine and the payment device. For machines operating in EXE mode, the U008 EXE cable is used. We connect the cable with nine pin square connectors to the EXE bus gap and the rectangular six pin connector to the circuit board of the machine. This connector is used to provide power to the modem. The black connector of the cable connects to the MDB EXE port on the modem. The type of audit cable depends on the protocol by which the machine operates, MDB or EXE, on the master device. In MDB mode, the cable is connected to the audit slot of the machine. In the executive mode, the audit cable is connected to the coin changer. The black connector of the audit cable plugs into the DEX port on the modem. The only thing left is to connect the antenna and to install a SIM card. You should install an external SIM card for which a special slot on the modem is provided. A PIN code should be disabled and no ban on receiving SMS is allowed. The modem is installed on the machine with magnetic holders. Install the modem so that when you open the door, the cables are not stretched or bent. The buttons and LEDs of the modem should be accessible and clearly visible to an operator who maintains the machine. We strongly recommend placing the antenna on the roof of the machine so that the metal case does not shield the signal. In places with high level signal, the antenna can be put inside the machine. The antenna is mounted with double-sided tape, which is under a protective film. After turning your machine on, the modem receives power and adjusts itself to work with the machine. It may take up to seven minutes for the modem to switch to operating mode. In normal mode, three top and one bottom indicators are lit on the modem. The modem receives power, then a GSM connection is established. The modem transfers data to the server. The status of the payment bus is OK. The payment device is now ready for use. The DEX indicator is not lit. The modem has not yet requested an audit from the machine. Now check the modem. Press the service button to request an audit report. The DEX indicator blink means the beginning of the audit. When the report is completed, the DEX indicator will turn off. After successfully reporting, the modem sends data to a server, which is processed by the indicator. The modem is ready for use.